When I was 50, I started on the unicycle. And then when I was 60, I started doing um, juggling. And while I was doing juggling, I saw an image, the image of this young woman on my husband's uh, alumni magazine cover. And so I painted that picture because I thought she was just too spectacular. Painting seriously since um, maybe 97, starting to show professionally since 99. So I'm in galleries. She's so strong. It's ridiculous. She's really strong. She does have some limitations just with kind of joint mobility because she is a little bit older, but that's really, yeah, she's awesome. She's a riot. Stop that leg. Oh, yeah. Over. I recommend this for everybody. It's really wonderful. It, it uses every muscle that you ever thought you had or didn't have. It's less important for this one, though. Star drop is a little bit more important because you have that extra. Interestingly, I didn't know what the goal was. I was just having fun doing it. But then it turns out that they have student shows. And then I discovered that not only do I like doing it, but I love to perform. The first one I ever did was I was the Nutcracker because I am not limber. I am not a dancer. So the Nutcracker just moves like this. And that was perfect. And I could have a terrific costume. So that's the start of my shows. Yes! Nice, Alice. Good. The harder for her, the better. She likes drop. She likes crazy things. She likes things that other people would find really scary. It's a mixture of a challenge and you sort of feel like you're making progress. You've got a trick and you learn how to do it and then you learn how to make it neat and then you learn how to make it fun. I recommend it to everybody I meet. It's terrific. It's so much fun. I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky to be able to do this.